Not even the depths of hell could have forged a diamond this special. Where is the back of my trailer? Uh, or not the back, but the entire thing of my trailer. Let's say we got left side, right side. So this would be driver side. DS would stand for driver side. PS would stand for passenger side, right? So normally what I do is the order as going out last, I would put driver side headboard because it would be all the way in the front. This would be the headboard. This would be the headboard. So this would be the tractor up here. Uh, this would be driver side headboard, passenger side headboard. Now I leave this for the order that's going out second to last, then third to last. So I would put driver side second, passenger side second, and then so on and so forth, right? So what I do is the orders that are going out last will go up against the headboard. So I like to have the majority of my material on the driver's side because for those of you who don't know, it's very hard to find opposite side street parking for an 18 wheeler. So if the material isn't too crazy, I would prefer to have it on the driver's side so I could just pluck and go. Uh, because when you pull into oncoming traffic, it becomes a sketchy, sometimes a dangerous situation very quick. And if you're not very, if you're not aware of your surroundings, or if the cars behind you don't know what the hell you're doing while you're driving down the road to pull onto the to, to the opposite side of the street, uh, you're gonna get yourself hurt. So uh, just be aware of your surroundings when you do that. So um, the only time that I don't put stuff on the headboard last is when it's something super sketchy such as like a leaning skid of mulch you always want to put the lean towards the headboard if this is the headboard you want to have it lean up against the headboard but you want to have the store straightened out as much as possible but like mulch insulation just just sketchy like super sketchy stuff that way that the headboard can block the wind from like really hitting it kind of thing but yeah so that's my uh excuse me i'm tired that's like my train of thought with my train of thinking so that way when you unload the trailer you as you unload it you become emptier and emptier but you're working your way from the back the back to the front so that way if let's say if this was going out first whatever material this was if this was going out first and you got a sketchy load of decking or something right here uh which is what i have on the passenger side right now um if you were to remove this first then this one right here would could slide forward if you had a like pull you know an emergency brake or something or other so uh but that's just my thing guys uh we're gonna go ahead get started i got uh one delivery to do now i gotta run well not right now but i gotta run to the gas station first top off the forklift then we're gonna go drop off that one we got one delivery going to canterbury which is going north and then we're going to go to North Wyndham, pick up, I think, one. And then we'll see what we get into. But yeah, I'll see you guys either at the next store or the next delivery, all right? Out.